Well, it's not exactly the kind of date you see on The Bachelor. An Albuquerque man is in deep trouble after taking his lady friend for a spin in a stolen car with meth and a stolen gun. Oh, and to top it off, he led police on a high-speed chase right through a construction zone. It is nowhere near MDC, but for the driver, it turned out to be the exit that led right to jail. North on Rio Grande, north on Rio Grande. That car is locked up. That game of bumper cars at the I-40 Rio Grande exit would damage his left front wheel, ending his desperate run a few minutes later. For a guy who police say was in a stolen car with meth and a gun, Anthony Cisnero was not keeping a low profile. The chase started as he merged onto I-40 and blew right past a state police officer near Coors last month. The chase would reach speeds of 116 miles an hour through a 55 mile an hour construction zone, at one point putting a scare into a construction worker. Watch as he tries to ditch the officer by crossing three lanes to sneak off the Rio Grande exit. It didn't work. Traveling on the wrong side of the road. After driving the wrong way on Candelaria and then 4th Street, the officer ends the chaos by spinning out the Mazda before other officers show up. Let me see it! And pull the driver out. Cisneros had a woman with him, Anna Lara. She was also charged for that stolen car, stolen gun, and the meth. Those charges were dropped because police could not prove that she committed a crime. She was arrested in a different stolen car just two weeks later.